Hey guys, this is Isn't Over, and I shall be reviewing another iPhone application for you. And uh, this time, we're going to be seeing Comic Zeal. My camera isn't focusing, but uh, there's the icon right there. Uh, Comic Zeal is a uh, comic book application uh, for iPhone and iPod Touch, and it's essentially a comic book reader. And uh, it's uh, it sells for five dollars at the App Store, and uh, it's better than most of the comic book readers I've ever used. Uh, so here's let me show you let me go through the the interface here this is the main uh, the main screen so you have uh, your uh, your comic books there they're categorized by uh, by folders here so I have my uh, Star Wars Darth Maul folder here I got Wolverine origins down here and uh, the last one is why the last man so if I let's just go into a Darth Maul here as you can see there's a there's a bookmark uh, image on top of the comic books the ones that I've already read through Essentially, if you exit the uh, the comic book uh, or the application for whatever reason, it saves your spot automatically. So uh, here I am. This is page three of there's a, the overlay. Page three of twenty five. It saved it automatically last time I was reading it. So you can just scroll like this. You have to drag the screen all the way like this. But uh, if you've ever used any other uh, iPhone or iPod Touch comic uh, comic readers, you will know that they don't usually scroll pages this fast, right? And uh, that's definitely a plus. I remember iComic, uh, it had like a five second delay when you're trying to, to move pages around. So that's definitely, you know, a, a, a much better response time. You can also read the comics in uh, uh, landscape mode, which is uh, better for most people. For me, anyways, I prefer it like this. You can zoom in or you can zoom out, like all the way like this to see the whole, the whole, uh, whole panel. Uh, what else? Uh, let me go back here to the uh, beginning there you go you have these these overlay controls here that you bring up by pressing this little uh, icon on the the very corner here you can take screenshots there see you can uh, lock the orientation this is good for people who read uh, as they are lying in bed so if you're uh, moving the, the screen around it's not gonna change the uh, the orientation of the image and that's good like if you if you've done any any reading on your iPhone your iPod touch while you're lying down in bed you know that that's that's a hassle because the image keeps changing on you the screen keeps rotating it when you don't want it to so uh, uh, these buttons are for uh, scrolling pages if you don't like you know doing it with your with your finger like this and this big button here goes back to the beginning so that's the uh, my Star Wars Darth Maul folder so let's go back to say Wolverine here we go so that's my Wolverine folder. I only have two, uh, th sorry, three comic books there. So let's open it up. Sorry, there we go. And as you can see, it's it's remarkable how fast this application works. Like I've used comic book readers on my uh, my iPod. I had a jailbroken iPod Touch before I bought the iPhone, and uh, they were very slow. And I have it also on my PSP, and not optimal at all. It's it's slow to the point of frustration, right? And this is pretty fast, and you know it's. It resizes the the image pretty fast. It doesn't you know doesn't lag too much or at all for that matter. Um, let me go back here to the last one. These are the only ones that I have in the the in the, the the only comic books I have installed in the in the app right now. So I'm reading Why the Last Man, which is pretty pretty cool. And uh, it just it really pleases me to see how fast the 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 pages turn because like I said the the big problem with the other uh, applications I've used before is that they were so slow it just it just annoys you, and uh, also it's uh, worthy uh, it's noteworthy to say that the uh, the the process of getting the comic books into the your your device is a lot easier than anything else I've ever used. You uh, essentially you go onto the the these guys websites the, the people who make the app and you download this uh, Windows uh, application and essentially all you do is you drag and drop your comic books into the the application it'll do its thing and then you click on sync and then all you have to do is take your iPod or your iPhone uh, your iPod touch or your iPhone and uh, connect it to the same Wi-Fi network as your computer and then just hit sync and that's it it's it's completely painless very easy if even if you're not a tech oriented person it, it'll be if you know how to drag and drop that's all you need to know to use this application so very useful and uh, yeah for I mean it's a little pricey right five bucks I mean really five bucks isn't that much money but in the context of the App Store five dollars is you know it, it's a it's a medium to, to higher range price right but if you read comic books a lot and you like having your comic book collection like I have a whole lot more I, I, I 
literally just bought this application and I just synced these these comics uh, here just to test them out but uh, I have a lot more and I'll be transferring my uh, the bulk of my collection into my phone because it's cool to have these things when you're on the you know on the go and you want to read like you know a couple pages of your favorite comic book so it's really cool so for five bucks I think it's uh, it's pretty like the like, as you can see the 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 interface is very slick and uh, you got a lot of interesting functions there, like you can take a screenshot, which is kind of redundant because, as you know, you can take a screenshot with your iPhone by holding the home and sleep button, right? But it's interesting that they added that for the people who might not know about that function, the native uh, screenshot function. So, uh, yeah, it's very functional, very slick. I like how it organizes your... Oh, let me go back. Click the wrong button there. I like how it organizes your collections. Sorry, I was out of the frame. How it organizes your collections like that, like it gives that little uh, folder icon there. And then, I, I don't know, it just looks neat. It looks like it's a, your little bookshelf and uh, with all your comics. So, uh, Comic Seal is the name. Five bucks is the price. And I'd give it a 4.5 out of 5, really. It's a really, really decent program. Uh, so, yeah, that's it.